Ah, okay. I'm just down here by the north shoreline of um, Cork Lake. And I just, like I, when I was walking, I was walking along Panamine Road here and uh, just to get some exercise because I need it. And um, I noticed this little spot here that I might be able to put my kayak in because there, there's really no launch point uh, on the north shore of, of uh, Cork Lake. And uh, there is another one, but I saw some people putting their kayaks in uh, farther back down the road there, but that's even more challenging than this to get in there. It's a little longer too. But this, this spot here is a possibility. It's a bit steep right near the end here, but um, I might try it one time because uh, the only, really the only way I can get into the north side of Quirk Lake is to launch down at the um, municipal boat launch on Quirk Lake there. That's way down south. It's a long paddle to get up here. So, <clears throat> yeah, I'd like to do some paddling around the north side here. I've already paddled, you know, all of Cork Lake, but, uh, yeah, it's nice to put in here sometimes. It would have been a nice day to put in today because it's not very uh, choppy out there today. Uh, I'll keep this in mind next time that I come here. The rugged shoreline of Cork Lake. Yeah. There's you know, quite a few islands out in Cork Lake, some of them big, some of them small. Some of them have names, some of them don't. Some of them have uh, ventilation shafts for the mines on the islands. Uh, it's, a, it's a fairly nice day today. Uh, there's sort of a hazy cloud in the sky, very thin cloud. Um, I chose to do a walk along Panel Mine Road today because the uh, black fly situation hasn't cleared up yet and it's just impossible to hike in the bush with those black flies. So uh, I'm still playing a waiting game. I don't like it, but uh, it's on nature's timetable, not mine. So, yeah, it's a nice spot here though. Maybe I'll just sit down here for a sec if I can. It's a bit steep. I might slide down. <laughs> Slide down to the bottom on my ass into the rocks here. Oh boy, there's a sharp rock there too. I wouldn't want to hit that one. Oh, my hiking stick is falling down. It's steep here. Okay, stay there. Okay. Yeah, I got a few deer flies. No, there's one. Oh, I'm sliding down still. I don't think I can stay here. Okay. Maybe I can put my foot on top of that rock. Okay. Yeah, that'll do it. Okay. Just taking a break here. <clears throat> yeah, it's, uh, it's hard to get into the bush now. It has been all, ever since winter ended, it has been. Because uh, the, the spring, the snow is uh, really slow and clearing up in the springtime and I can't hike in that wet snow even with snowshoes on. And then after that, the black fly started. And you know, just after the black fly, well, not just after, a while after the black fly started, um, we got into some hot, humid weather. And some people say that that kills off the black flies, but <laughs> that wasn't the case this year, so I don't think it's true. I don't know what, what uh, encourages the black flies to uh, hang around so long this year. They, they say it's the, the weather, but um, there could be other things at play. You know how nature is. Humans sometimes think they have it all figured out when they, they haven't even scratched the surface. So, nice quiet spot here, yeah. I haven't done any fishing this year. I do want to get some fishing in, but it's kind of late in the season now. I like to fish in the early spring, but I just couldn't get into the lakes in the early spring this year. They were all still frozen. So, I do what I can do, what nature allows me to do, and this is what it allows me to do right now. It's a Sunday today, so I'm not, I really wasn't too, uh, you know, too fancy about getting anything, anything big done, you know. I didn't want to do anything in, well, the bush, like I said, is off bounds right now because of the black flies. Yeah. Hmm, yeah, I feel like paddling a bit now, but I don't, my truck's way far away now, and 
you know, I have the kayak in my truck, but it's pretty far away now, and I don't want to go back and get it. I'm not finished hiking along Panel Mine Road yet, so uh, I want to go to the end of Panel Mine Road. Oh, there's another fly. Oh. Sometimes them deer flies, they'll they'll bounce off you a hundred times, and then once they won't bounce, off, they won't bounce. They'll stay there and they'll bite you. <laughs> so you got to be careful because they bite, they bite hard. Anyways. I think I'll continue my hike now. I, I can never sit too long. I mean, if I sit for five minutes, that's a long time for me. I gotta keep moving, but it keeps me in shape too, so let's go.